A year ago, Valerie Vargas noticed a bump on the inside of her throat. I just thought it was, you know, a little fatty tissue. It turned out to be much more serious. Vargas had thyroid cancer in the form of a large tumor. Her tumor was actually not only large, but it was actually compressing on her trachea. Vargas is part of a growing trend. Take a look at this graph. Since 1998, the number of thyroid cancer cases in Texas and in Bear County have been steadily rising. In 1998, there were only 71 cases in Bear County, and in 2007, that number more than doubled with 175 cases. Still, endocrinologist Dr. Kathleen Hands says the trend isn't necessarily cause for alarm. As technology has advanced, we're able to see these little tumors in the thyroid, but they've probably been there all along. In fact, Dr. Hans says 50% of the cases found today are less than one centimeter, which would not have been detectable 10 years ago. We see an increased incidence, but the actual mortality for thyroid cancer has actually been stable over those 20 years that you're talking about. Vargas says she's thankful for the advancement in technology that allowed doctors to find her tumor. Otherwise, she may not have received treatment in in time. Jennifer Dodd, KSAT 12 News.